So we went out. When I come back, and I said to Alan, where's my vape? My other vape? So I said, I bought two, and I've only got one. So I went down to reception, and when I got back in the hotel, in the room, I didn't realise the one I'd taken out, I'd laid on the, where we make the coffee. Oh, all right. Oh. I didn't, forgot about that. So I went down to reception and I said, um, have you had a vape handed in? No. So I said, well, I've lost one. So she said, well, when you came in and you asked for the milk and tea bags, <coughs> you had a vape in your hand. I oh, there's a bit of smoke going. Anyway, I went back out and I checked in the stores where I'd been. <coughs> Nobody had handed anything, so I thought, oh, I've bloody lost it. Couldn't think at all, so I went to the vape shop and I bought another one, right? <laughs> he set it all up. It's a lovely, it's better than one I, better than the one I got. But all told it was fifty quid. Oh, oh Jesus Christ. You cheap the smoke. And then the <laughs> coils were twenty five because I've got two packets. Cause anyway, I was in I'd get sciatica a bit and I was in bloody awful pain last night with walking around that bloody town. And I'm thinking, I'm laying there and I'm thinking, I wonder if that vape is in that case. <laughs> anyway, I get out of bed, I pull the case out, go like this, and there it is in this bloody black bag, and I thought, I've just bloody spent all this money! <laughs> <laughs> right, I'm going to take it out. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Parliament House. This is a reconstructed Parliament House, all put back together. It, it was purpose built as the Senate House a long time ago. Put back together in millennium year, over ten months. Quite a remarkable achievement. There were no photographs or diagrams showing I the can't read that in, in this light. The team from Manchester National Heritage got it right. The name of Robert Farga, the editor of the Modus Herald and he knows democracies coming in England and Wales with the Great Reform Act of 1832. Well, I say it's come in. Tony Benn on YouTube there, and he went to Benn, who was a fantastic lecture on democracy, and he says, do you realise the 1832 Reform Act only allowed 2% in trade, as it is known here about smuggling, sir? In the view of members of this House of Keys, it is legitimate trade. And one that has aided the economy of our island for decades. Yes, we politicians were all into this, but we're not so nice to the view. For new honourable members, I should mention that Captain Creon was appointed to the Keys as a hero of the Battle of Trafalgar. He was first lieutenant on HMS Victory. What we're going to do, my next part, we're going to get stuck in. I'll be around 25 minutes with you. We're going to charge over the drawbridge. Right, I have just been saying the castle as a defensive building is formidable. There's outer walls and outer gatehouse. If it never fell to force, if we had charged over that as an attacking force, even to get here, 
you're totally vulnerable to the defender. So it never fell to any opposing force. Frankenstein creature here, half chicken stitched to a pig. They're trying to make a legendary beast, a cockatrice, which was a, a chicken and a serpent. There's a suckling pig there. Um, that castle is a pastry castle, which would have had sweet things in. Um, probably pigeons, meat pies. There are apples and pears. I saw you there. <laughs> <laughs> um, cinnamon, which would have been ground into drinks, I'm told. Um, there's also a couple of ceramic pieces which hint at their sense of humour. Firstly, the one I'm touching now, usually called a fuddle cup. There are four cups joined together. They're joined underneath. The liquid goes into a hall of dark. This time it's another English Civil War. We touched on the War of the Roses upstairs, where the Stanleys did very well. <laughs> So as I said, uh, they start at 10 second intervals, one by one, and they have practice sessions, so we have a week of um, qualifying laps.
They will be running today, I think the horse trams are running today, not running tomorrow and not running Tuesday. Break the camera truck. I wish your clock could stop. <laughs> 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 Thank you. 